Cherokee 265B, I do believe this is actually their best selling fifth wheel. It's certainly our best selling Cherokee fifth wheel here at Haylet RV of Coldwater, Michigan. 7,335 pounds, ideal family bunkhouse fifth wheel. You know, it's not this big five slide, 40 foot retirement crazy thing. This is something, take your family out, have a good time. You can be rough with it, it's gonna keep on coming back. This is the one that gets you home from the dance. Um, they they uh, set the tone right off here with a big high profile fifth wheel nose cap and that's fully automotive painted. It's not gonna like sun fade on you. But they, they didn't go with like a three quarter cap. They went with the, the, the real deal up here. That's pretty impressive. It's also going to help protect that uh, upper seam where the roof meets the cap wall called the termination strip. That's a uh, very common point of seam failure if people don't keep on top of their maintenance. This helps uh, prevent any of that nonsense from happening in the first place. Uh, underneath this, you're going to see uh, like a really rough textured wall here and the idea behind that is to be like a little bit stone deflecting it can absorb an impact from a stone and deflect the stone and not wreck anything power front leveling jacks because you actually do your leveling with the power jacks and you just drop the rear stabilizers again camper not a glamper um seal gripping slide walls because again you got to have it reliable you need this thing to perform and that's exactly what this is going to do for you cherokee is awesome for something and that is massive windows they do put very large windows in pretty much wherever they can and they make those big giant slider panels so you can have some excellent airflow and i do like those wheels they got going on there uh hit on a couple utility things here black tank flush outside shower 18 gallon per hour water heater um we like to put the folding cargo rack on the back because this has like four upgrade bundles. There's the value core XL tier XL package and then limited package. And then we add a couple things on top of that like the spare tire and a few other widgets and whiz bangs. This is pretty much how we're gonna bring them in uh, with a very rare exception. So if at any point you like what you see here and you, you wanna know what the price tag is, there's a link down here in the video description that says check for price and availability. We sell a bunch of these through the year and discount packages change through the year. So if you'd like to see what we have in stock with current pricing, that's how you can do that from the comfort of your own home. Um, the This is a dual entry. This is a, a super popular travel trailer floor plan just adapted for a fifth wheel. All it does is just gooseneck the bedroom basically with that direct entry bathroom door. You can see that's an easy foot flush so you don't need your face near your business. And a little detail thing I look for, this is the stuff I see where brands can save money or you know by, by cutting corners, but they didn't do that here. They went with triple entry steps on both entry doors. That's a nice feature. These are also really aggressively friction hinged doors. You see that that door just stopped. It didn't come anywhere close to smashing the side of this trailer. You can barely, barely got it to click right there and I heave that thing. There you are. Um, I like what they did out here. With <laughs> this, this blue light, I always look at that and I go, laser beams! It just, I don't know. Always <laughs> makes me think of that. Don't really know why now that I say that. So we've got the same blue LED backlight behind these speakers and at night, this thing glows really cool under the awning because the bottom of the awning skin is white, so this whole thing is going to glow really aggressively. Uh, we generally do not include uh, TVs with our Cherokee family trailer simply because I can get you a larger or equally sized or better grade uh, TV for the same money from the aftermarket big back store if that's a hard requirement for you. Frankly, you could do the same thing just as easily. But what is neat is this is prep for an outside entertainment center. These TV hookups down here, whatever you're playing inside, will mirror on the TV outside. So if you're watching a race, if you're watching a game, if you're tailgating under your sweet patio awning, you're not going to miss anything. Now right next to that, we've included, this is one of the options we've added, the mini camp kitchen. This is a Cherokee exclusive feature. This is very cool. This chunk of cabinetry in the kitchen is really awkward and difficult to get to and build around. So they said, what if we opened it up to the outside? And outside kitchens are popular, direct entry bathrooms are popular. What if we can give you the features of a 36 foot fifth wheel in a, in, in a what, 26, seven foot package? Very, very cool. So you've got dad's medicine cabinet out here to keep some ice water and some barley pop on hand. This is a second outside shower with hot and cold water and that can act as your faucet or on this side of the trailer frankly that is hyper hyper functional because you can hose the kids off with it if they've been out in the lake and then you can send them into the shower to hose the turtle slime and fish guts off them and then they can go to bed also little cooktop outside happy tailgating folks and when you're done with it slides away easy peasy lemon squeezy bigger entry handle never offends anybody either so as we step inside here you're going to see uh, 
the the whole theme and feel and decor from the exterior is mirrored on the inside. Uh, for instance, we've got that same blue LED laser beam uh, accent light up here. Now, what's really neat is this light above the slide out is either just a really fun accent light or it is the ideal night light to help the kids get to the bathroom or help you get to the bathroom at night. And then, poof, all the lights kick right on. It's got a very good lighting package for a budget focused trailer. But they've done things like, again, the big windows, there's, there's Todd, I call him Hot Toddy, uh, or High School Musical because he looks like a kid from High School Musical. Anyway, I don't know. I don't know why I felt the need to share that with you. It doesn't matter. Extra glass, you know, big windows. Windows and lights are terribly expensive. In, in the RV business, they're the two most expensive total components in most trailers. So uh, to, to see people actually invest in big lights and windows like that, it's a big deal. Now, this is something Cherokee did first, and you're watching everybody else copy it now, because that's the way this business works. This little folding armrest pretend theater seat jackknife sleeper sofa with storage below that they have here. Um, they're the first that had that little folding armrest with the cup holders there, and it's so super cool because when you're sitting here, a lot of times you just don't have a place for a drink. Now you do. The big king dinette. This folds down to like a seven foot bonus bed. Now, that tabletop, this, the bathroom, this, all this is a sealed pressed membrane. It's, this is what the material is just, it's just a resin. It's a molded resin. The stuff is awesome. Waterproof. Uh, so that if you're, if you, the kids spill a drink or let's just say you take your iced tea inside and set it down and it starts to sweat and condensate on the outside. It can't water damage the table. You just dry it up and go back to camping. Now there's storage all the way under the dinette and with the upgrade bundles we have on our Cherokee family RVs, getting to that storage could literally not be easier. This has full easy access storage to those side benches there. And uh, what's nice is you get to kind of see a sneak peek of how the floor is put together because this does have uh, that 5 8 tongue and groove plywood flooring. Um, 3 8 full walkable roof deck with 5 inch roof trusses. Average of 16 inch, or pardon me, 12 inch on center wall studs. One of the best structures in the business. You know, the, the the trailer is just an awesome like infantry soldier. This is the Forest River infantry soldier. It's the one in the trenches taking care of your family every day. Now there's some really smart upgrades they put here in the late 2017s that don't exist in the early 2017s. They've got double USB plugs and household plugs by every single sleeping space. And you've got those on both sides of the upstairs bedroom as well. And you don't have to throw the kids to the upper bunk because they included a ladder for you because nobody wants to throw their shoulder out getting Junior to bed. They purposely leave this door well slotted because you've got a bigger Max Air fan up there. That thing can service the whole house. So if you're dry camping or if you just don't want to crank the AC and you want some fresh airflow, you get that good spring fall camping air. Spring and fall camping personally are my favorite. I love fall camping. I love fall camping. Uh, you can uh, leave your windows open and get a nice breeze rolling through here. Still have a good shower skylight. We saw half of the bathroom earlier, but just to give you a peek, remember waterproof counter there. Um, I've always said Cherokee has a best-in-class bathroom because you got the bigger fan, biggest-in-class medicine cabinet, biggest-in-class sink, easy foot flush toilet, protective shower wall surround panels, and a skylight. I mean, there's I don't really think there's another brand that can do all of those things at, at this money and size. Those things can be done in the business, but I don't know of anyone else that does it at this price point. And a big real pantry. This is something that they adopted about a year ago and it took off and I absolutely love it. Instead of that toothpick super thin pantry that you have to reach up to your, you know, your armpit to get the mac and cheese out of the back, this is just easy. And frankly, this is so big, you can use pantry space, you can have kids' clothes, you can have shoes, you can you can multi-purpose this one area. So, we talk about how the countertops are waterproof, and what that allowed them to do here is recess not just the stove, but also the sink. So you have total kitchen counter space with no loss there, but you can always just flip the lid on those things and have good prep space, or, uh, you know, uh, utility space. A um, little pull-out sprayer faucet, pretty handy little widget there as well. Uh, double big drawers here instead of uh, three small drawers. They go with two big ones at Cherokee. I don't know that one method is significantly better than the other. It's just something different they do. It is nice to be able to put big stuff in there, however. And again, extra little accent lights under this. Again, perfect nighttime nightlight to be able to see and cruise around here. I do like that little closet right next to the entry door. And uh, the that entertainment wall, it has like a reclaimed barnwood look to it. Just a very earth tone, down to earth feel. You know, Earth to Tony, 
Are you there, Earth Tones? Uh, residential ceiling fan. Again, get that airflow going. This thing has a decent amount of cubic foot of space, and there's plenty of room above the slide out. So I said, why not? Let's throw a fan in there and, you know, push some air around. Up here in the bedroom, you do have a sliding pocket door for mom and dad. Remember, this is a camper, not a glamper. So this is a, a simple bedroom, but very effective. The bed does lift for storage. Remember, those double sets of plugs on both sides of the bed. And if you're a bookworm, this is cool. You, uh, you've got a dual element LED light here. Tap it once and it glows blue. And you can, once again, see how that reflects off a light surface like my pasty white guy <laughs> skin. I, I tell you, I've, I've got, uh, you know, I've got tan lines below my, my Fitbit here. It's getting, it's getting pretty sad. Um, but uh, also, a nice shelf up here with uh, these extra plugs so you can have extra phone chargers and stuff or a CPAP machine right up by your head. And they are making thin RV friendly ones now, by the way. Or tap it again and boom, we get lots of light in here. So, uh, TV against that wall as well. Again, awesome, awesome, like, we, you know, first timers camper or, you know, casual camper, something like that, or, or something like, you know, our kids, they're, they're six and they're eight, and we want a camper that's going to take care of them now. And then after about uh, eight, nine years when they're done camping, then we'll swap it out and get the, uh, you know, couple's retirement luxury fifth wheel. That is exactly who this is built for. Cherokee is and has been a top five brand in the business for a very long time. This is a very serious player. They get the job done. And uh, I tell you, uh, with the huge growth that they've had the last couple of years, the number of trailers they're cranking out, uh, Real, really impressive service record overall. They're uh, one of the best performing high volume builders on the market. And that's something I can really respect. So give us a call, take care, stay safe, have fun, happy camping everyone. And remember we do have hitching, pieces, parts, financing. Uh, we, you know, obviously welcome trades of any kind. We can put this thing on a truck and put it in your backyard or we have trucks here, we can hitch it up and do a package deal for you. Doesn't matter what it is. All we need is the opportunity uh, to put this together and I don't care where you live. We got sharp pencils and we make deals happen and we don't lose deals for nothing. So have a good time, happy camping.